Hello, in this video we are going to learn about exponents. This is the continuation of my previous videos and now we are going to learn the fourth law of exponents which is the negative law. So the negative law is a to the power of minus m equals 1 by a to the power of m. So if we have a negative power in the numerator it goes to the denominator as positive power if we have a negative power in the denominator, it goes to the numerator as positive. So let's take an example. 2 to the power of minus 3 can be written as 1 by 2 to the power of 3. So the negative has become positive. Now let's take another example. 1 by 5 to the power of negative 2 can be written as 5 to the power of 2. So there is a negative sign in the denominator. So it goes to the numerator as positive power. So this is the negative law. So now let's learn the fifth law which is the identity law which is very easy. It's just a to the power of 1 equals a. Any number to the power 1 is always the number itself. So let's take an example. 3 to the power of 1 is 3. 15 to the power of 1 is also 15. So anything to the power of 1 is itself. So now let's learn the next law which is the zero law. It states as a to the power of 0 is equal to 1. Means anything to the power 0 is 1. For example, 5 to the power 0 can be written as 1. 22 to the power 0 is also 1. You can even write 68 to the power 0 is 1. So anything to the power 0 is always 1. In this video, we have learned three laws. Negative law, which is a to the power of minus m equals 1 by a to the power of m. Identity law, which is a to the power of 1 equals a. Zero law, which is a to the power of 0 equals 1. Isn't it very easy? So for more tips and tricks, do like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.